Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm going to be sharing some pieces that I have picked up for winter. It is getting a little bit chillier now, so I wanted to stock up on some pieces that will really see me through this season. Before we get started, I wanted to share my size for reference. I'm a UK size 8 and I'm around 5 foot 6. The first piece I'm going to share is this one from Under the Stories. It's a green jumper and colour is not really my thing, but I couldn't help but fall in love with this particular tone. I've been edging towards a lot of greys and quite dark muted tones and I think that a colour like this helps to break it up. It's slightly cropped which I really personally like because it means I can wear it over trousers and it just sits really nicely. I really like that boxy silhouette, I think it goes really nicely with slim fit jeans, it really helps to balance out the frame. My next jumper is also from Under the Stories. I'm a great fan of Under the Stories and pretty much all of their pieces. So this jumper falls quite long, but one great thing about it is it's really lightweight and flowy. So I can tuck it into my jeans really easily. It doesn't bulge out at all. This particular knit is really soft and comfortable. Another great thing about this jumper is it's really big, oversized and flowy. So you could definitely get away with wearing a thermal knit underneath, especially when it gets colder. A piece like this is so versatile and it's a piece that I would wear for years. I have just come to the end of one of my favourite grey jumpers which is why I had to repurchase a grey knit that will see me through this season and another few seasons to come. You truly cannot go wrong with a simple grey jumper, it looks amazing with a grey coat put on top. I think you can look really chic and sophisticated and you can dress it up or dress it down, you could wear it for work or you could wear it casually. And roll necks in winter are a must for me. I've really been loving sweatshirts, I find them so comfortable to wear, especially now that things have changed, we are in our second lockdown in the UK, we are hopefully coming out of it, but it means that I want to wear comfortable pieces, both in the house and if I go for walks or errands. It's hard to describe the exact tone of this jumper, it's kind of a marley fabric, it's got a few different tones running through it, but it's a really nice neutral stone khaki sweatshirt. I found that I've actually been able to make this look a little bit more sophisticated with a really smart coat on top and I just love how comfortable and how oversized it is. I did buy this in a size medium so I can have that really oversized feel. Next up is a knit from Zara. I haven't really been shopping at Zara much lately but I did pick up this particular jumper because it's just a classic, you can't go wrong with it. I really like the fabric, it's really soft and it's really comfortable to wear. I wanted something that would sit really nicely underneath my coat. A lot of my camel jumpers are really oversized and really thick, so it doesn't sit super well underneath my heavier weight coat. One thing I really like about this particular jumper is the outer seam detailing. I think it looks really unique. I think it helps to elevate the jumper and just take it from being a really simple classic jumper to something more interesting. I picked up this dress from H&M because I just fell in love with it. I really love that smock detail dress. There was a dress like this that I saw and fell in love with from Totem, but of course it was about five times the price of this one. I always notice that I find amazing dresses at H&M. This is definitely a piece that, if hopefully we can dress up for Christmas, even if I'm in the house, this is something that I would really like to wear. I absolutely love the tone of the dress. I think it'll also look nice underneath a coat, maybe with some chunky boots underneath. It's really flowy, the fabric is absolutely beautiful. The one thing, it does have a slightly low back, which I would want to cover up because it's winter, but it's such a beautiful dress and it looks even better with a belt just to help cinch in the waist. I definitely see myself wearing this this season, but I do see myself wearing it next summer as well. Moving on to my favourite thing, which is outerwear. The first piece I want to share is this coat from Jigsaw and it's absolutely beautiful. I fell in love with it the moment I saw it. Jigsaw is an amazing brand. Their pieces are amazing quality. I have found that they wear so well and I really love this coat because of the contrast detailing. I love my outerwear and because in winter you can't make a statement with every piece, I like to make it with a coat. That contrast style follows through to the belt, which I really like. It's all of those finishing touches that make a piece look more expensive and it's just such a beautiful coat. I'm so excited to keep wearing it this season and I know it's something that is an investment piece and I'll wear it again. Another coat that I have is this one from Under the Stories. I feel like this is the perfect winter coat because it literally goes with everything. It's one of those coats that you don't really need to think about what you're wearing underneath and making sure it complements it. It pretty much goes with everything. 
I really like that boxy masculine silhouette. I think it really helps to make an outfit look more premium and it just pulls everything together really nicely. I don't actually have a coat in this particular colour which is why I wanted it and when it comes to winter because of darker tones I really like to accessorise with gold and gold tones just to help lift the outfit. This has buttons going down so you can button up to keep warm. It's really great because it's quite oversized which means I can wear a really chunky jumper underneath and it'll fit really nicely. The next coat I have to share is this one from Joseph. I was on the hunt for a classic camel coat and this one just screamed out to me. This is one of those last you a lifetime kind of coats. It's one that's really never going to go out of style. It's a real investment purchase and I'm really excited to be able to wear it for years to come. A coat like this will take you so far because there are so many ways that you could dress this up. You could wear it casually, you could wear it formally. It's really really versatile and that's so important to me. I'm always looking for pieces that have longevity, this is definitely that and you can see that the quality is amazing from all those finishing details, it's a really soft fabric, it's really comfortable, I like that it has a slightly relaxed fit. The one thing is it runs slightly oversized so the sleeves are quite long but I actually quite like that because I like to make my outerwear look a bit more relaxed so I can pull up the sleeves on this one. Again, a coat like this complements gold tones so beautifully. I feel like it goes with all of my accessories and it just complements everything so well. I'd also say this is a coat that I could throw over everything and anything and it'll look beautiful and really timeless. My next coat you might have seen already if you follow me on Instagram, but it's this coat from H&M and I absolutely fell in love with it. I really love the silhouette. I think it looks so chic and so sophisticated. Again, this is a very timeless coat and it's a very premium quality coat, especially for H&M. The quality is amazing. You can really see that the detail is thought through on this one and I have absolutely loved wearing it. I think it makes my whole outfit look more premium, more luxurious and I really love the white tone. I think it looks really nice in winter and it looks really beautiful when paired with neutral tones but also you could definitely inject a bit of colour with a piece like this. You have a lot more room to experiment and have fun. I pretty much live in denim, I absolutely love denim jeans but at the moment because we're in the house again I haven't really been wearing them so I've been looking for comfortable jeans to wear. This pair is from And Other Stories and I really love the And Other Stories denim range. I feel like the pieces are really good quality, the denim is really hard wearing and it's in a really thick denim. I really like this tone of denim because I think it really helps to lift my outfits especially if I'm wearing really dark muted tones. It gives a slightly vintage look, I really like the element to my outfit and I really love the fit of these jeans, they're relaxed and I really like that casual vibe you get. Moving on to trousers, I have these trousers from Arquette and I already have this pair in black and I have been getting so much wear out of it. I find that even though we're in lockdown, dressing up and getting ready still helps me feel motivated and helps me feel more proactive. So a pair of trousers like this that has a really nice relaxed fit and elasticated waistband is really comfortable to wear through the day. I also really like wearing wider leg trousers in winter because it means I can layer up underneath and wear some thermal leggings and you won't be able to tell. I really like this fit because it incorporates both a casual element but also a smarter sophisticated element too. And I love pairing it with just a simple turtleneck, some trainers and then just glamming it up and dressing up with some gold accessories. Following on from that, I also purchased the trousers in navy because navy is such a great piece to have in your wardrobe. It's definitely a basic piece that I would say is an essential and is one that I get a lot of wear out of. So the pair that I have in black already is a size 34 and I've noticed that it runs slightly small, especially around the hips and I'm a little bit heavier around my hips so I had to size up in this. The good thing about it is that it has a elasticated waistband so you could tie it up to fit you properly. But I love pairing a piece like this with some statement shoes. I think it really helps to elevate the outfit. I really like having a relaxed and effortless vibe to my clothing and you definitely achieve that with something like this. 
Moving on to a smarter piece of trousers, this one is from Cameron Millen and I have been wearing these trousers so much. I really love that charcoal colour, I think it goes with a lot of my outfits, so it's something that's kind of slotted into my wardrobe really easily. This is a piece that would look great, just quite simple like this, but also with a really chunky oversized jumper and maybe a belt to help bring everything together. I like styling a outfit like this with some trainers just to help make it feel more relaxed and laid back and it's really effortless when you style it with trainers. And because I'm wearing quite a slim leg trouser it looks really great with a oversized coat on top. I think everything feels a bit more balanced. Now when it comes to winter I like to really accessorise and I like to go for my gold jewellery. You guys would have seen the pieces that I'm wearing in this video all the time. I wear them religiously. They're from Misoma and at the moment for Black Friday, Misoma are running 25% off. It's a very rare occasion that Misoma run 25% off site wide. So this is a really great chance to one stock up on some pieces that you might have your eye on. I bought myself and my sister this matching necklace. I really love that locket detail. I think it's so cute and also it's a really great time to also purchase gifts for your loved ones. Misoma is a brand that I truly stand by because the quality of the pieces is amazing and they last such a long time. I have been wearing most of my Misoma pieces for years now and they don't date and I think they just complement everything so nicely. And one thing I find I do is I wear the same pieces every single day and I can't help but reach for those same pieces. I will leave links in the description box for all the pieces that I'm wearing in this video and also to the Misoma website so you can get 25% off. Finally, I don't think it would be a winter haul without some more winter accessories. So I picked up this scarf from Arquette. I really love the check print running through it because it's my way of being able to inject a bit of print into my winter wardrobe. Obviously in winter we wear a lot of chunky jumpers so I don't get a chance to really play around with more fun elements like this. One thing I really like about this particular scarf is that it has both navy tones, pink, blush tones and the cream and the camel tones. So it pretty much goes with everything that I own. And my final scarf is this one from Totem. I have had my eye on this for the longest time and I am so excited to finally have it. I really like that it looks like a geometric print. Again, this is really going to help to lift my outfits, make it feel a bit more exciting, more put together. And I really love that really oversized scarf look. Another thing I like about this is that it's got two tones running through it, so it doesn't feel too blocky and it adds a bit of dimension to my outfit and to the actual design of the scarf. Moving on to shoes, if you have been to my channel before, you'll know that I am a massive fan of Phaja. These trainers are so comfortable to wear. You do have to break them in, but once they're broken into, I could wear them for a full day's wear and they don't hurt my feet at all. This is my favorite style from Braja. It's the Campo style. I have worn my other pair to Oblivion. One thing I love about this one is that it has a khaki color element to it, which will really complement all the pieces that I have been wearing recently. And also I really like injecting a teeny bit of color into my trainers. And finally from Under the Stories, I have these very simple classic boots but I really like the detailing on the toe with this one. It has a slight square toe and I really like that it has that sock boot element. I think it looks really seamless and I really like wearing it with pretty much everything. It goes really well with denim but also I have worn these out and they're really comfortable to wear so I know that it's going to be a boot that I will wear religiously through winter and it's going to be really comfortable. And that's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.